Hey guys, welcome back to Fly Boys. Now it's raining. Now it's not. Now it's raining. No, it's not. Dude. I think this I think this island is acting like an umbrella for us. But guys, you probably remember this area. Last video, my brother and I, we did a little NPC battle. My Rilfum took on his his porks. His pork army. Dude, that was so much stinking fun. I think some people got mad, but but really we were just we were just having fun. Dude. Oh my goodness, when we do those NPC battles, man, I don't know, dude, okay, this guy's gonna explode something. I don't know what it is, it just gets me laughing, okay, get off me, get off me, you freaks. So, okay, this is the second NPC battle that my brother and I had out here. The first time, he took our only helicopter out of here. And the next time I logged on, there was no helicopter, so I was basically just stranded on this island. <laughs> so, let's see how he likes it. Let's see how he likes being stranded on an island. <laughs> That's actually how I made this thing. I had just enough materials to make this bad boy. So, hopefully he has enough materials. Oh my goodness, I just remembered something. Uh-oh. I just remembered something. Oh, you can't see my character because I'm in an airplane. I am dressed as a pinata. <laughs> and you might be wondering why. Why in the world would you dress up like a pinata? Well, I thought it would be fun to have, I have a subscriber server for anyone who subscribes to my Twitch channel. And <laughs> I just thought it'd be fun to hop on the server, dress up as a pinata and hold a bunch of different fun items and have them destroy me and explode me and get all the items. So I forgot to change my skin back, I gotta do that. But guys, today what we're gonna be doing is working more on the submarine. Like, I don't know man, we don't have a date set for the battle yet, but it's gotta be pretty soon. So if that's the case, I gotta finish the submarine. You can see it right there. Whoops, a little too close. <laughs> you can see it right there. There's the sub. Oh, it looks so sweet from up here. But yeah, we're gonna be doing some work on the submarine. But first, I'm gonna have to grab a lot of materials and stuff, so I'm gonna make a cut. I'll grab some materials, start get started, and we will get going on this submarine. Yeehaw! Big Lemon's my big on 2000. You think that's pretty funny, huh? Take my helicopter. Oh, take my other helicopter. Put them up. Put them up in the air so the mobs aren't around. Oh, you think that's pretty funny, do you? Actually, that is pretty funny. <laughs> so, we got pranked by Lemon. What does this say? Big Lemon's my big on. Dude. <laughs> you know what? I'm not even mad. I'm not even mad because we'll get him back in the battle, man. This battle comes around, we're gonna destroy him. And I, actually, I think we're planning on doing a skirmish pretty soon. Dude, okay. So, Cube made this. Holy crap, Cube made this. Let's see, where's my sniper? Where's the sniper? Uh, sniper! Let's zoom in, oh baby, yes. So I was watching Cube's video, very nice video, I actually, you might see a link to my Twitter page. Oh, there's an NPC up there. If you, dude, just go to Cube's channel. I was gonna say, you can check the link in my Twitter page where I liked it, but just go to Cube's channel, check out his latest Five Boys video. This is sweet. I'm not gonna show the whole thing. You gotta see Cube's video to see it. Oh, baby. Very cool. All right, so if you guys, if you guys are new and haven't seen this sub, let me give you a little tour. It's not finished. These are all working turrets. Oh my goodness, these, these are supposed to be smooth like that. I really don't know, I really don't know why these turn to that cobble texture. Okay, here we go. We're going into the submarine, and most of you have already seen this before, but in case you haven't, this is kinda like the, I don't know, the steam room, or <laughs> I don't think submarines have steam rooms, but this is like a machine room kinda thing. We got all of our, all of our power, this is power we got. Pulverizer, redstone furnace, induction smelter, magma crucible, fluid transposer. <sighs> we got a lot of machines. 
<laughs> so over here, they still working on the transition. Over here, we got the sleeping quarters, and then the dining room with a stocked refrigerator. Actually, I need to grab some food out of here. Let's get some cooked salmon, get some carrots. That's pretty good. I've actually been eating this slime. This goes down smooth. But this is the last room that we haven't even started on. This is the control room. So my idea for this room is to basically have, dude, do what I did. Google, Google submarine control room and you will see some interesting things. A lot of textures that I'm not able to do, but I'm going to replicate the best I can with the resources I have. I was messing around in survival. Today's gonna be a start, and hopefully by the finish, it'll look pretty sweet. So I'm going to get started, and I'll be back in a minute. All right, so I cleaned things up just a little bit, so it looks more like a room here. I put this down as the floor, and it's a little bit more colorful than I expected it to be. Oh, actually, I'm just realizing how this pattern goes. So it's like blue in a diagonal, orange in a, di in a diagonal, red, gray, grayish green, I don't know. But yeah, so there is a pattern to it, and that's kind of cool, but I had an idea. I want to, I want to just like change things up a little bit. Don't need this. So, just to get rid of that pattern, yeah, oh yeah, because dude, I'm telling you guys, look, Google, look up the interior of a submarine, and you'll see, it's not the prettiest thing in the world, because early on when I was making this thing, some people were like, oh no, that doesn't look beautiful, but you gotta remember, not going for beauty, going for like rustic and and industrial. I hope those are the right words I'm looking for. But check this out, baby. Boom, boom, boom. Yes. So we have these on the other end as well. And they kind of remind me of drains. So on a submarine, who knows? Maybe water gets in there or something. Some, maybe bodily fluids drain down there. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I'm sure they have toilets. I don't have a toilet on this sub, but I'm sure they have toilets. So yeah, these are just great. Who knows? Maybe if there's like a leak or something, yeah. We'll see if there's a leak, then it drains through the drains. Perfect. All right, now another important matter, guys. Dude, it's been a very long time and we still have not named this submarine. It's all my fault. You guys have given so many great ideas and I have waited, I have procrastinated. Now is the time. We gotta pick something. <laughs> we gotta pick something for this sub before we before it gets exploded. So I am taking suggestions again. <laughs> so guys, now we were talking about different ideas like the SS this or SS that. And turns out, man, where are my technical? Dude, I am low on technical blocks. What is this? Futura factory block blast. Okay. Dude, we gotta make some more technical blocks. So we were talking about like SS whatever, but people were saying SS doesn't really apply to a submarine. I hear you, zombie. It doesn't really apply to a submarine because apparently SS means steamship. I think that's what it means. Dude, how in the world? Okay, that is not correct. You do, how do you do this? Stone, iron. Beautiful, we got the stone. Give me the iron. Oh, tell me that, oh, that's not gonna be a decent enough amount. Come on, show me, show me. Here we go, okay. Oh, it makes 32. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, we got 64. We're doing good. And what else do we throw away? Sorry for this full inventory, but dude, when I'm building stuff, I need everything. Like, I'm trying to find something that I don't need. I need everything. Uh, <laughs> kind of. Okay, let's throw this down on the ground. And I'm going to set this up. And then we'll pick it back up. Dude. Oh, I get as annoyed as you guys do with full inventory. 
but like I said, I need all this stuff. So that is kind of like, it's not the best computer, but this is the best I got. It's pretty cool though. You know, you got all that, it's like text or something going across the screen. I think that's pretty cool. But like I was saying guys, SS means steamship. A submarine is not necessarily a steamship. I don't know what it would be classified as. Like I guess M, V is like motor vehicle. I don't know, there's all these different categories and our submarine does not really fit under any of those categories. Okay, now what do I need? I need wedges, blast. Okay, we'll come back to that. <laughs> okay, I, dude, I made all these materials off camera. And now I gotta make a bunch again. Okay, let's let's jump on here. So guys, I am open to ideas. Like people were talking about naming it like Johan or something because of my Dragon Ball Xenoverse character. People were saying like name it the SS Sub Club because that's what we we call the Twitch subscribers, which is another cool idea. But guys, I am open. So any ideas? The Pink Destroyer, because we're we're gonna be going against Pink Team or <laughs> Pink Team, Team Pink. So whatever you guys got, I am open to it. All right. So where are these technical? Ha! <laughs> these are the blocks that I have created. All right. So let's put these here. Put this there. And oh boy. Okay, put that there. <laughs> so this is gonna go along the bottom here. I like that. Oh, 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 and that's kinda inset. Oh, oh, that's inside of it. Okay, I wasn't planning on that, but I actually like that. That's a space saver. Dude, that is nice. All right, and instead of these torches, let's do the glowstone trick. That's why I had these carpenter's blocks on me. I'm doing this glowstone trick, so let's do... Let's do one like here. Oh, crap. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops. Get in there. Yes. And then make it even. One right here. Oh, here comes the water. Yes. So let's do this glowstone trick. I love this thing glowstone trick. Shift. Right click. And you can hear it. You can hear it make the sound. And I got some regular basalt to patch it on up. Boom. Boom. <laughs> yeah, that's not supposed to be cobble like that. Hey, it, at least it's lighting up the area though. So we can get rid of these torches. Nice. Okay, so I made a picture and I put it all off to the side. Okay, so what do we need next? We need this. Okay. And I did something like this. Yeah. Something like this. And like this. Oh yeah. And then I did something like this and like this. Oh yeah, baby. Now, the next step, you know what? Yeah, yeah, this is good, this is good. I'm actually, dude, the world that I made this in previously, this is going to look a little different, but I think this is gonna look even better. Cause we have a little bit more space, so this is gonna be, this is gonna be nice, I think. Oh yeah. Okay, give me those stairs, and throw this down for a minute. Put these stairs here. So how do we want to do this? Hmm. Oh, that's cool. How does that look? Let's see how this looks. Kinda cool, kinda cool. Oh, very cool. Okay, I like it. <laughs> I like it, man. <laughs> All right, so that's looking good. Next, let's see. Hmm, I took some of these laboratory blocks. And guys, another thing too, all of this stuff, I can change it if I need to. So don't, don't panic if you don't like it. I can change it and I will change it if I need to and I don't like it. So I was messing around with these, these little arrow things. It doesn't really apply to anything, but I like it. I'm just wanting this area to look like, this is where technology is. This is where 
things are. <laughs> All right, so that's looking pretty good. What else do we have? We had wedges. Hmm. Huh. Dude. <laughs> this refrigerator idea, it's great, but it's kind of hogging up my space. Let's put that in there. Yeah, it's kind of hogging up my space because you got one, two, three different types of food on me. That's annoying, and I'm not getting hungry at all. So let's just let's just have one type of food on me. This is great, dude. What am I even? What am I doing with a sign? <laughs> I don't need this sign. Okay. So let's see here. Let's pick up that glowstone. I'm gonna need it. Now, the thing about building, I'm not a master builder or anything. I'm not the most amazing builder, but I've seen some tutorials, and one of the biggest things that people say is really important is just adding details. And details are really important. So that's why that's why I'm trying not to do like flat wall, flat wall here, having we got a slope here, we got these slopes here those little corners in there, all these little things add up to little details. And there's some more things I wanna add as well. So here we go, check this out. I can't change this basalt because this is basalt on the outside, we need that. We can't change these exact blocks, but I can change the texture, kind of. I can add a little detail by adding these hatches, whoops. Adding these hatches, and that adds a little detail. So what did I have here? I had just regular technical blocks here. And guys too, I am open to suggestions and ideas because a lot of you guys are really familiar with the with the mods that we use. So if there's some if there are some things in this mod pack that you think would be good for this room, definitely let me know. I'm always open to suggestions and most of the good ideas that it seems like I have, a lot of it comes from you guys. All right, now I had what did I have? I had these guys when I did this in a creative world. That looks kind of cool. So this is just supposed to be like little working desks, that's kinda good. Yeah, that's kinda good. <laughs> what else, let's see. Yeah, I gotta make some wedges. Let's make wedges, I can't even remember how to make them. <laughs> and I don't even know if I got the wood for it. I'm pretty sure it involves sticks, and carpenter's blocks, and Probably more things than we have. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, let's see. To make a carpenter's wedge, ooh. So we can make six of them. That'll do for now, and actually, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where are the garages? Could have swore I had garages, I probably threw them away. We have more. <laughs> I was thinking of doing some stuff with these garages as well. So let's see what these look like too. Cause the garages are cool cause you can put a lot of different textures on those too. All right, so we got six wedges. We really need more. Huh, let's go like this, whoops. Like this, and like this. Like this, and like this. Yes, excellent, excellent. Now this is a little different than I had it in my creative world as well. We're making a lot of changes on the fly, but sometimes you just gotta look and see how things are looking and change it as you go. That is pretty cool, I like it. So we're just, this room is the technology room. And the only, really the only purpose it's gonna have is for when I'm doing the UAV controlled stuff and if you wanna see me do some of that and you haven't, check out my, I think it was a few videos before this. There's like a remote control helicopter on the top. So I'm using this thing in there. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Let's get the garages out. Oh my goodness, okay, okay. Dude, I think we're onto something. Oh, I didn't even show you guys. Look at this, dude. 
So I think this is supposed to be a character from Viva Pinata. <laughs> this is the best I could find as far as a pinata skin. There aren't really a lot of pinata skins online, so if you guys want to tackle that project, go I say go for it. Okay. Ooh, these are cool. These are cool options. Oh. Okay, what could we put there? Would this look cool there? Oh man. That dude, I think that looks pretty cool. Oh, I like that. I like that. Okay. <laughs> and yeah, and we could have it up like that. Oh, the possibilities, dude. What about Okay, now we're just getting crazy. What about the Hey. Hey. Uh, I was gonna say what about throwing them up there, but okay Let's scratch that idea. Okay, dude. That is cool Nice now. What if we flip these up see this is this is my building process I just try a bunch of stuff see what looks good. Yeah. 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 Yeah, so that is interesting. Okay. Oh What else let me see I'm looking at the picture. I'm looking at what we have I can throw some more of these up so this is good. Can I reach? Barely. That's the beauty of this tinker stuff. I got a double jump and an extra high jump. You can jump as high as you want, baby. Love it. Now I might extend that. Yeah, all of this is a work in progress. We're gonna change things as we go. And I did cover up some light, so that kind of stinks. Yeah, I need that. I think it was that block. Yep, that one. The one that turns into that cobble basalt or whatever. <laughs> so we need that exposed for now. Maybe I'll maybe I'll change one of these. So dude, we're cooking. Like I said, we're probably not going to finish this today. But at least we can get a start on it. Was there anything else? Yeah. At least we can get a start on it. So I think this is looking pretty cool. It looks like a control room to me. What do you guys think? Like I said, if you have any ideas, let me know. I think we're gonna call it for there though. It is super late for me right now and I'm probably gonna fall asleep mid-recording. We can't have that. <laughs> um, but anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, as always, feel free to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next Flyboys. English <laughs> professors. <laughs> <laughs> all, all of them? Yeah. <laughs> Prepare yourself for <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>